It's time for Eric Plays Human Resource Machine, Episode 6. Extra Life Edition! Uh, so, it's Extra Life Day. And... When are we playing Human Resource Machine? And... Uh, There we go, there it is. <laughs> All right. So, I can't remember if I was working on the um, branching path, but I'll just go with the normal story mode. Imagine each thing in the inbox is an address, and each address refers to a tile 0 through 9 on the floor. For each address in the inbox, pick the letter at that address and outbox it. Congratulations, you can now access tiles on the floor indirectly. Observe this example to see how it works compared to what you've been doing so far. So it says, okay, so it was copy from 12. Versus copy from 12. Interesting, okay. All right, let's just do it here. Okay, so. I see. So first, I need to copy two. Let's say ten. Copy from ten. Outbox it. All right. So grab something. Copy to ten. Copy it from ten. Outbox it. Um. Jump back up here. I think that's it. Pretty simple. Let's see. That seems too simple. Alright. Right on. Yeah. I got two green lights there. String storage. I just noticed my guy has gray hair. I think my guy has aged. I don't think he always had gray hair. I think, uh, I think he's gotten older. Special covert assignment. Managers requesting strings from the floor. This is holy moly. And not really discuss what they say. If we play TV messages to for someone else. Get. Oh my god. And forbidden. Alright. Using the inbox of the address of the town on the floor. Red. The request item for the floor. And all following items on the floor until you reach a zero. Repeat. Get Tarakis. Hmm. Okay. So when I get something, and then I want to copy from Oh, yeah. I want to copy to here. Yeah. Until I get to a zero. So the first one's gonna be the. Hey, uh. Huh. All right. So bump. Twenty-four, or bump. Twenty-four. No. Bump 24. Alright, then... Copy from... 24. 
Um... Mm. Jump if zero. Back up here. Okay, if the first... No, hold on. Let me think here. Hi, Virellas.tv. That's an interesting name and an interesting... That you have a plug there. Hmm. Well, um, I'm playing for uh, Extra Life. If you want to donate, the URL is right there. I'm playing a human resource machine for a little bit. So this covers me if the first one is zero, and this will cover me for subsequent zeros, I think. And... If it's not a zero, I want to go here. It's not zero here. I want to go to the up box. It's not zero here. I want to go to the up box. And I think I've got it. Let's see. The. Right, so that's a zero. So the is the first word. That's a zero. So the T A R Tar oh, target. Oh, snap. The target. Holy sh Okay, so it's going to be target for the first word. The target. If I get this wrong on the last thing because I messed up the final jump, I'm going to be upset. Target X. Is. Is gonna be the next one. The target X is. Awake. Oh, snap. <laughs> I can speed this part up a little bit. Sorry, X is awake. Um, take. Okay, the target is awake. Take. The. Take th this. The target is awake. Take this. Holy snap. I don't even know what that means, but it's kind of scary. All right, I got the speed challenge though. Okay, string reverse. <coughs> Whoa! Ole! Yada u era how? How are you today? Haha! Haha! Okay, now seriously, for each. Zero terminated string in the inbox, reverse it and put the results in the outbox. 
Repeat. I just want to see if that still had a copy from. Okay. Um, let's see here. Obviously, when you get something from the inbox. Hmm. <laughs> Put salt in the outbox and repeat. Alright, I think I have an idea. Let's see. Copy, I think, copy to... Ah, yes, I got it. I'm going to use this to take care of it. So copy to what this is referring to. Um, and bump that number. Um... Zero. Then I want to copy from here, subtract it. Okay, copy from here, up box it, subtract it, and repeat. Unless it's zero. In which case I go back to the top. I think I got it. Let's see. Zero. Ah, I have to do a bump minus before I copy from brain. Alright. That gets it back to zero. Ended up with two bumps. Why? Ah, there we go. Oil. That's some kind of a loop. Got L. Jumped it. Okay, now you got zero. Decrement this. Put that in there. Bump. Be from there. Um. Ah, 
Uh, hmm. Jump of negative is what I need here. Actually, let's try this and see what happens. But now I had a negative <laughs> bounce. I got an out of bounds error achievement. Uh, that's funny. All right, <laughs> what do you think you're going? <laughs> this guy's so upset. I had a feeling that was gonna happen because if I jump negative, then I need to. All right, what I need to do is if negative. Bump it up and then jump back to the beginning. Boy. It would have been funny if these would have been, um, what are those called? Were there? Same back and forwards. Ah, it's gonna bother me now. Um, it's not gonna come to me. That's okay. Cool. See you the elevator. All right. Inventory report. Inventory check. Counting verification. Surprise audit. These are a few of my favorite things. So let's get started. We're seeing the inbox. Send to the outbox the total number of matching items on the floor. Wow. Man, how do I do that? Hmm. Wow. Any idea how I would do that? Holy moly. <coughs> I don't seem to have any compare commands here. I gotta think back to my, uh, that's a crazy face you got there, Varelis.tv. Um, think way, way back to assembly. How do they do compares in assembly? I mean, if I do this, what do I get? Get indirect to a tile with a letter like B. Only numbers are allowed where you think you're going. All right. I don't necessarily want an inbox. Let me think, let me think, let me think, think, think. Copy from, copy to. Something to do with this stuff, and I'm not really good with pointers, unfortunately. I'm more of a Python guy. Um, man, I haven't got the slightest clue.
All right, you can add references to each other. So everything can be a reference now. Hmm. Ah, okay, I think I got it. I think I've got it. Inbox. Copy to... Copy it to 15. Alright. So now... I want to... Um, Alright, let me see what that leaves me. Okay. So I've copied to 15. I've got it in my in my hands as well. Okay. So how do I make this zero again? <coughs> I'm keeping track of stuff. Cause I'm thinking is I could subtract this stuff. Um, subtract. I don't know what happens with that. Let's see. Got an X. 22. I get 22. Um, if it was the same, it would probably be zero. Um, Zero. Uh, zero. Oh, fourteen. And um, oh my God. I guess I can't bump 14 because... No, I do want to bump it, okay. Um. But how do I move on to the next, the next one? I've got, I've got no other numbers. I have to take a break on this. I'm not really sure what I'm supposed to be doing here on that one. Um, okay, uh, so I'm going to do another uh, short break, and uh, after that, uh, might come back to this, might do some Team Fortress. We'll see. All right, see you in a little bit.